Dude, that's insane. He has to he has to adjust his camera to where this is the base of that. And then you Okay, now came back like you're licking it. Okay, no no. Okay, stay right there. There you go. Now loon your face, go a little little forward. Okay, now tilt your head back a little bit. There you go. There oh oh stay right there. Let me see. Look ridiculous. Hurry up. I gotta get it perfect. Uh, hey. Okay, hang on, don't move yet. Okay, there you go. <laughs> you guys can't make me laugh and I won't get it on there right. Perfect! Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. Okay, come on. And then just lick, okay? Ridiculous. No, no, you can't. Give me your, give me your coat. <laughs> Two for just the tower at 145. So it's a dollar to use the bathroom, or if you've purchased tickets to go up the tower, then I guess you can show them this, and you get to use the bathroom for for free or included in your ticket price. So we are headed up the tower. We uh, pay twenty dollars a person, twenty euro a person. Um, but one thing to note: you cannot take any bags with you. You can take your phone and take your camera, but any bags you have to check or leave them with somebody down on the ground. So up we go, and I guess. As you climb, it's gonna feel like we're leaning, so I'm looking forward to seeing what that feels like. Oh, it is leaning. Whoa, <laughs> you feel it right off the bat. So you totally are leaning when you climb into this thing. It is crazy. This feels really weird. So Jason's on the same level as I am. Look how much taller I am than you. <laughs> yeah, this is crazy. So if any of you have been to a vortex, this is exactly what it's like. The leaning buildings in a vortex. Oh man, and we have to climb stairs crooked. That's nuts. I'm like falling against the wall. Whoa. Oh, now we're leaning the other way because we're going around to the other side. Check that out. So this is a lot of steps. So luckily they have these little pullouts because some people are like marathoners just wanting to climb to the top. It is a warm day and very humid, so we'll pull off, let others pass. We're not trying to win a gold medal in exercise. <laughs> Finally made it. Catch my breath. Take her on to the left, Beth. Come on. Oh, this is crazy. Just some fun. Not the biggest fan of heights. And when the tower is literally leaning, like you feel like you're going that way. And the wind's blowing that way. Yeah. That's not mm -hmm. fun. Oh gosh, I feel like my feet are just like going forward. Because they are. So you only get so many minutes up here and then they actually push you out and ask you like, if you want to come back. Like so. five minutes. <laughs> oh, there's more. I guess we're going up now. Man, look at how warm these are. That's crazy. Oh, falling in the wall. Whoa. You gotta get your sea legs. So it's like you gotta get your sea legs. Ooh.
after spending about 20 minutes climbing and going to both levels, we are being booted to go back down, but 20 minutes is plenty of time to get all the photos. Okay, back to the bottom. Not so bad. Uh, 300 steps, uh, but it's a pretty warm day today. So uh, just know that it's 300 steps straight up into the sky. You're basically <laughs> walking the stairway to heaven, I think. Uh, it, it was uh, pretty neat, though, to uh, get to experience that. Uh, but yeah, definitely know that um, anybody could do it. They have pull-offs where you can stop and what have you. But uh, it's 300 steps straight up. And then, um, yeah, I don't know. I, I assume that includes up to that bell section, yeah. too. So it gets a little steep up there, but still. Awesome, have to do it. Yeah. We are eating pizza, pizza, pizza at Pizza. This is a uh, Aperol Spritz. If you look around at all these tables, this is a very uh, popular drink in Italy. We see it all over. I like my beer. It's a long lane. So we've been driving north from Pisa up to where my sister lives in Vicenza and uh, getting about 38 miles just of tunnels. Insane, never been in a tunnel that long before. It breaks it up, it's not 38 miles long. I think the longest one's around 5.8, somewhere around there, but all together 38 miles. Uh, but anyway, you come across these auto grills, pretty much a uh, rest stop on steroids. Got, you know, stuff that you would normally find, but then also has a deli, a market, uh, and it, actually the vehicles go right underneath it. It's kind of cool, just different than what we're used to in the States. But yeah, if you're ever uh, in Italy and need to stop for a break on a, a long road trip, check out the auto grills, they're pretty neat. Look at that. How much is that? Is that a stuff? I don't know. What the frick? Yeah, grab that. Oh my gosh. That's the biggest lollipop I've ever seen. That's crazy. It can be yours for $13.90. Yeah, $14. <laughs> 